All right, cool. So we're back. Um, you're at prehistory. Okay. I do remember. Okay, yeah, I do remember. Character-wise, though? Okay, I do remember. So I thought we had... What's her face? Uh, yeah, I honestly don't remember. <laughs> we're just playing with her. Anyway. Uh, but yeah, as you can tell, we're back. Uh, last we left off at, we did go to the prehistory. So last stream, I think we went through... Uh, it's, I'm actually just going back so I can remember her name. <laughs> uh, Isla. Yeah, Isla. Alright. We met Isla. Went through here. I think last room we ended up going through... I forget what time period it was. But we went through and ended up uh, went out across the bridge. I think we met Frog again. And he was looking for like a... St oh, that's it. Yeah, we had a bit happen. So we ended up going for to find the Massive Moon Sword. We found the parts of it. Uh, or at least we found one part of it. They were guarded by these children and ended up being demons. Looking creatures. Uh, and then they give us part of the Massive Moon. And then I found out that Frog ends up having the other half. So now what we have to do is repair the Massive Moon. And we just got the stone that we need to actually, like, forge the Massive Moon together. I think ant Antipod... Um, dull? What? What? No. <laughs> That's a lot of words I just saw. <laughs> uh, let's see... Antipod bomb. It's enemies in the circle of fire and ice. Actually sounds kind of cool. But yeah, so we got the dream stone. I think that was it. It's called a dream stone. And I believe we're bringing it back to the forger first in present day. I was actually trying to remember. I'm like, am I going back to frog first? I'm like, no, we still have to forge the sword. So we have to go back to present day give what's his face the dream stone the forge the mass in it and then we're gonna get it the frog and i think we're gonna take down what's his face uh, for some reason i want to no all right listen it's been a week <laughs> it's been a week but yeah um I can't remember exactly what that guy's name is. And the villains. Not Lamos. The one who's summoning Lamos. That's the one that's like skipping me right now. I mean, this is a good way actually to level up too, so I'm actually not against doing all this stuff right now. Uh, do. Yeah, it works. Like I wanted to do like a spin attack or something. Couldn't get it. Yeah, it's a, we're almost yeah, we're almost back. You know, I think about I love that Kirby emo. This is the That's a really good Kirby emo. Okay, so going back in time. Oh, we're going through the thing of trigger, the portal. Yeah, that's the thing. All right now, I gotta figure out what time period. I think it's the one with the. It's a Proto Dome? No. Uh, yes. Yeah, Medina Village. So we're going to Medina Village, and then we gotta go find what's his face, the Smith Swordsman person. 
And then from there, they'll forge the sword for us. So it should be good. Mel, 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 Melchior. I think that was it. <laughs> Dear me, you truly found Dreamstone. Yes, I will do quite nicely, but then I can make the blade whole again. But first, the Master Moon. Now, the Dreamstone. How in the world did you. No, I suppose it does not matter. Make yourself at home. This will take some time. He's probably just like, how the hell did you just find a sword from the past and then a stone from the prehistoric times? I'll lend you a hand. Thank you, Luca. How are you going to fix it? All right. <laughs> all right, all right. Do I... Just let him do his thing. Of course, the Dreamstone must be refined if we are to repair the Mass Moon, but that's not all. The blade itself must be activated as well. If you work on the Dreamstone, I will take care of the sword. Okay, fear not, the Great Luca knows her way around a workshop. Please. Alright, so she's working on the stone. He's just gonna smooth the sword out. Guess we're kind of just here. So how's everyone, how's everyone going? How's how's everything? Okay. <laughs> All right, it's done. Could you bring me the dreamstone? I'm done here too. Do you have a cup? All right, let's get started. I let them do their thing. I don't want to touch anything. For some reason, I feel like if I touch something or I move, I'm going to ruin something. I let them do their thing. Uh, sorry to keep you waiting. That's a sword. Behold the Massimum in all its glory. Wow, that's the same sword we gave you. If you were expecting lesser work, you shouldn't have come to me. Okay, Coronel, let's take the Master Moon to Frog. I was kind of hoping I could use it. Alright. <laughs> He's probably right now like, who the hell is Frog? <laughs> uh, was it the Resonance? It was the Resonance. I did actually kind of want to heal. Like a little bit. Did I use Cure? Probably. Trying to navigate. <laughs> Alright, let's go back. Um, I think I'm going to keep the party the way it is just for now. So now we haven't used Marley all that much recently. We were using Robo a lot. So I think I'm going to... Actually, again, we haven't used Marley or the Robo. We've been using Luca with Marley a lot. And they're both healer. Eh... Alright, I'll keep Luca for now. <laughs> I'm, I just like changing my party up a little bit here and there. Not to play with everyone the same way all the time. Uh, square? No. No, I think it was... Not Primo Dome, just the top one. Truce... Was it Truce Canyon? Yeah, Truce. I'm trying to remember the year. I'm like, is it 680? Thinking like these guys shouldn't be, yeah. But they're very weak. I am a bit beat up with Chrono, so I think the moment I get out of here, I'm probably gonna take a moment to at least get back to the end and rest up. Thought about using my items, but I think I'm just gonna spend some skill and heal. It would probably be a little bit quicker. Or at least not even quicker, just. Saving myself from uh, wasting some items. Uh, 
which ones again? There you are. How are y'all doing? Hey, 10 bucks just to rest full HP. Take it easily. I do like all the characters actually have a... Uh... Okay, I was gonna say, did I figure it out finally? I didn't hear the music. <laughs> Still haven't. Still haven't. No. Uh, yeah, let's go south. So I have to go past the bridge. There's a forest. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, there's a place I have to go. All right, let's go to the uh, meet frog. Guess he'll rejoin our party then, more likely or not. That was weird. <laughs> I'm like waiting for an attack to happen. Okay. I think that's what was supposed to happen. <laughs> so a little, little confused there. Alright. That went actually as expected this time. I need to get a hidden. There we go. Alright, I thought I was just about to leave Snick alone, but that's whatever. Oh wait, now it's a counter attack. Even better. I think it's not really doing much damage, it's just not dying. I think that was a benefit I think I miss having with Robo. Robo at least can do damage just like Chrono. At least close to it, you know. The other two are like slightly slower. Okay, so is the rain attack actually like a counter attack with the frogs? I'm actually just like realizing this. I thought they were just like regular attacks. <laughs> Alright. Now I just feel like I want to take out the frogs. Or at least have the snakes, yeah, I'll say. And the snakes take out the frog. I forgot they can just literally eat them and heal. It's Marley left though. Alright. Hey, frog. Got something for you from the past and the past. No. Past and the future. Come again. This sword. No, it could not be. Moon. I must ponder this turn of events. You may remain here for the night. So I just saw you a couple minutes ago. Oh, that's weird. Oh yeah, something happened to Cyrus here, right? Alright. Cyrus, you're leaving, aren't you? I am. It's a long past time we reclaimed the badge from the Frog King. And I need to see that sword with my own eyes. Cyrus, his kingdom has need of you. Lean and I need you as well. See that you return. As long as there is life in these bones, I shall come what may. Well then, by your leave. Sir Cyrus. Something with Sir Cyrus I don't like. <laughs> On behalf of the knighthood, we wish you a safe journey and Godspeed. My brothers. 
But he is fine. I don't know. I trust the kingdom's protection to you. See that she is kept safe from her enemies. Because they always proclaim like Sir Cyrus is like this big hero, right? Pardon the delay, let's be on our way. Who's that? Glenn, you be careful too. It's Glenn. Be well, your majesty. Who's Glenn? Fight apparently. That sword. So you seek the hero's badge, Knight of the Kingdom of Men, and take it. Then, if you can, croak. That's what I mean to do. Oh, it's Frog Cyrus? Nirvana Strike. <laughs> Crack. I'm beaten. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing like a little, little teen spirit, though. Anyway, horrible joke. Uh, Piff, filthy badge. Do not think I'll forget this. Clah. Or maybe Frog is Glenn. Glenn, watch out. Cyrus, your sword. Massimo. Oh. Ah. <laughs> is, that you, is that the best you can do? Without your sword, you're nothing. Grr. You're not best than me yet. That's, uh, what's his face? Ozzy, I know of. <laughs> Cyrus, I'm done for. Listen to me, Glenn. I'll hold him here. Use that chance to escape. I don't think Glenn's frog. I don't know why. It's one of them. One of these two people are a frog, I think. Uh, stay in the only kill us both. Go, Glenn. Magus. That was it. Oh, yeah, I was right with the name. For some reason, I was thinking, like, it's Magus, right? <laughs> and you better worry about yourself, Cyrus. You do not think I cannot speak right now. Uh, I do not think you have the time to be concerned with the well being of others. This is it, Glenn. Go. Gah! Just charge it on the head. Well, and Cyrus is dead. <laughs> Cyrus! Run. Run, Glenn. Queen, take care of Queen. I beg. Holy shit. Burnt him. What's the matter? You're not going to try your luck. Grr. Ah, like a scared little frog with Glenn's frog. <laughs> Alright. With no pun to jump into. How about Lord Magus? Can't you give him a more fitting form? Very well. No act of defiance goes unpunished. No! Oh man. <laughs> That's more like it, you spineless one. Okay, so Glenn is frog. Ten long years have passed. Have I the strength, Osiris? Oh, so sad. Awaken Chrono. I do not know how far my skills will carry me, but I will put them to the test. Let us go to Magus's keep. His strength is no small thing. Do you understand the odds we face? Nothing can beat science. The good guys always win. Alright. So, I know Frog has a heal too. I'm trying to decide if I want a Frog or, or a Marley or Luca. I think I kind of. I don't know why I like keeping Luca around. <laughs> I feel like she's like very good, like support wise, like attacks. 
So what happens if I bring her in? Like an aura whirl and ice sword. At least I can heal everyone though with Barley if I need to. Do I need to? <laughs> Supersonic spin and cyclone sweep backstrike. Oh nothing yet with. Okay. Um No, honestly, I kind of feel like Marley just for now. Let's do Marley for now. I have been using Luca a lot. Let's get Marley like a, some chance. Even Rob will be using a bit. Yeah, we'll do we'll do this team for now. Look at Frog! So Frog got the Massaman? Meant to attack that snake. That's better. I had to double check Frog. <laughs> Love the flex thing though. It's always a little bit. I actually do want to double check Frog though, like equipment wise. So he's got an iron sword. He's got an iron sword? Alright, let's change stats a little bit. Strength plus two. Use attack at defense, cannot control her. Alright, I'll use Berserker Ring. I'll try that. I think I gotta get him a better weapon though. This is current sword's a little too weak. Should I cut the other weapons I had? <laughs> Wait, why is he? Oh, is that the Berserker Ring? And I can't control them. Okay, good to know. So in the long run, Berserker Ring really makes the character better. Like a lot better. Stat-wise, but the problem is they're just doing their own thing. <laughs> you know, this is actually it's not a bad thing to do right at the moment. <laughs> just for now. Like once I get out of here, maybe I'll get unequipped it. I want to go to a shop see if I can buy him a better sword. Let's go to go to like prehistory. I did sell a lot of my old weapons, which looking back might not be a good thing now. But look at the sword he's holding now. I thought he was holding Master Moon. Kind of looks like it. Unless he's always had that sword. I might just realize on this now. Will the snakes attack each other? Curiosity. But guess we'll never know. <laughs> I think it's no. I think they'll only attack the frogs. Which, you know, poor frog. Okay. Let's go to a city. Or a town. Just go to a marketplace. Tata's Elder House. So none here. So I think it's just a tavern market. Alright. Alright, so you only have equipment stuff. Nothing to really like weapon wise, like equipped. We'll be sticking with Iron Sword for now, then. Uh, 
Let's definitely get rid of the Berserker ring. I think, like I said, Pusker will hit right at Mass Moon. Wait, really? Oh. Wait, hold up. Can you equip it? No. I was a little curious in my win. Huh? Can I Chrono actually equip it? I don't think anyone can. In short. Um, Alright, so let's go to the keep. We'll save here. I'll give this a try. Ah! Stop that. Oh no, it's Cyrus, run. That's oh, like a little Glenn. So Cyrus is kind of like an older brother to him, maybe? Thank you, Cyrus. Glenn, there are times when a man must stand and face the things that trouble them. But it hurts to be hit. I cannot hurt another. Not even them. You're too soft, Glenn. Cyrus. They're just blowing in the wind. <laughs> Glenn, I've decided to join the knighthood. I thought as much. It'll be fine night, I'm sure of it. Won't you come with me? Hey, what did you do? I, I cannot. But why? You're a better sword than I. You always have been. Having the nerve it takes to be a knight. In a real battle, the fear would take me. No! So I fell off, became frog. I wonder what happens if you actually call him Glenn. It just gotta be some type of Easter egg. I feel like. This would be the type of game I feel like that would definitely do that. The badge, the hero's badge. The Massa Moon, if you please. Say, like, take it yourself. <laughs> My name is Glenn. Long have I carried Cyrus's hopes and dreams, and now I bear the Mass of Moon as well. Henceforth, I claim them as my own. I shall slay the Fiend Lord Magus and restore our honor. Get cutscene. Glenn. I 
get them watching animated and in this style. That's actually so super cool. <laughs> For a second now, I'm like, I hope those stones don't become like stone golems or something like that, like some type of enemy. <laughs> Alright, so we're in Magus' keep. Cool. So is Frog still like, using Massimo? So I feel like I wanted to actually equip it as a weapon. But it feels like it's only a weapon frog can use. Also, I am doing like little to no damage. Okay. You know what? It actually might be because of the enemies. I was a little worried it was because it was frog. Let's see. Okay, I think it's the enemies. So I'm not doing like any type of damage. To use ice. Yep, I'll do it. So these enemies have to use magic on. Alright, let's see. Let's do lightning. It's lightning too. We need to look at that next time. Could it be that you wield magic? I thought only fiends can play it now. Might be able to learn it too if you were if it's at the end of time. Is there a bat following me? Yeah, seriously, why is there a bat following? Can I take frog to the end of time? <laughs> Let's go back. <laughs> Hold up. Uh where is the gate? I think we're gonna go back for him. See if we can bring him with me. Maybe we can come back into the past eventually. Oh, biggie. <laughs> Rock's fine. Hey, right, see if we can sneak by. So if we can bring Frog with us. What would he learn water, I guess? So what's his, uh, whatchamacallit? Alright, he's water too. So he would also learn ice and stuff. I can bring Frog. I might have just destroyed the future. Oh, I can bring Frog with me. Hey. Alright, let's, uh... Let's just do this. Hi again. Now there's a weird fellow. Looks like his power is wire. And a frog who... I guess. Ipso facto minimo magico. I have to beat this guy afterwards. All right, you learned to use magic. Excuse me. I want to try it out. Yes. So he gives you stuff if you try it out. He's got to like play a K on me. I was joking. <laughs> I want to try it out. Let me kill you. Then we'll try it out. Uh, let's do it, you know, one uh. I might be able to try anything. So he uses just plain water. Not just, uh, ice. Nice. Also, I think he got extremely tough. <laughs> yeah, I'm dead. Let's 
Making any new friends? You bring them to see me. Okay. I'm like beat up now. Now we're good. Uh, okay. I think I'm gonna bring Luca. What peculiar new guest? You're from the Middle Ages, yes? Yeah, I want Luca and stuff, Marley. Well, then again, actually. I wonder if there's some way you can mix like water and ice, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and save. And go to True Scan? Yeah. We on our way. Probably like, you know what? I am gonna argue with these people. <laughs> Do I know magic now? Yes. Do I wanna know why? No. But honestly, it is cool that I actually know magic now. Quack. How you doing, number? Hope your week's going well. Ice water Doltec. Sword stream Doltec. Sword stream. Uh, shower enemy in a stream of pain. <laughs> Sweet. Bathe all enemies in icy shower. Cool. I'm down with these. Bolt. We'll be on the Hope we're doing well, friend. Okay. So I have to go. to the Magus Keep. And then, then we'll start the whole thing. <laughs> the whole dungeon down here. That magic cave. Well, it's not even the keep, we're just in a cave. The spider that's following us. And I still can't open this. I want to open it. <laughs> so badly. Uh, what we got? Hello? Let's see. Let's do Let's try lightning too. Never tried it before. Damn. Lightning too is pretty good. <laughs> oh, that, not gonna deny it. Not bad. That's not good. They just take my items. I was like very confused there. <laughs> All right, let's do, let's do ice water. I don't want to be doing that too much. I feel like it's required for this dungeon. It's because there's so many enemies. So at least if we can get, all right, we'll do it again. I think an ice water off. So honestly, I feel like that's all I really have to do for like every battle I go into. Just find them like that and then do, uh, the attack. The message is scrawled in blood here. Beware the jugglers and the fiend lords keep. Strike them and they tighten their defense against blows. Cast spells upon them and they strengthen their defense against magic. So I have to like find like a mix between, maybe? A little bit of magic, a little bit of uh, attack. I should probably save <laughs> before I go in here.
Hello. You knock. This is it. I feel like the bat is Magus. Like watching over us. And he just has eyes everywhere. Fiend Lord's key. Like, there's a reason why there's a bat following us, I feel like. Like, why are you following us? Alright, uh, let's see you some ether. Hello? Guess the main door is locked. Oh, this is probably fine. <laughs> Hi, children. This is our treasure. Let's play. He nope. <laughs> How do you? Yeah, wait, what the hell's going on here? Forgive me, I was wrong. Please return to the castle. Frog, you're safe. Nadia. Forgive me, I was wrong. Please return to the castle. Uh, Kronos, this is where you've been since the fair. You had me worried sick. Uh, I don't like the silence. Can't do anything. I'm extremely uncomfortable. So we'll go to the left step. Where are you? I'll open this. What is happening? <laughs> is that a sword there? Get an ether everywhere. I want to talk to this bad and be like, all right, listen, <laughs> what's happening? But they're like memories? I was not there before. Ozzy. I kind of figured the bat was following us around. Welcome, Glenn. Or should I say, Sir Froggy? <laughs> Wahaha. Never expected to see you here. Are those your replacements, Sir Cyrus? Lord Magus is a tad busy right now. You'll have to take up your business with me. After you take it up with Master Swordsman Slash and Flea. Magician, that is. All right. Oh, lovely. And all 100 beasts in this keep, of course. Okay. Like extremely uncomfortable with everything going on right now. All right, so that's not even the door there. That's just a mirror. See, there's a hundred beasts that we have to fight. I'll have to do I go back now? Yep. Dance. The God of all fiends is born tonight. Ah, the sacrifice has arrived. It's a lot of it. All right, I'm gonna use icy water. Is 
So I feel like I've been attacking a lot with Chrono. I like change it up a little bit. Yo, <laughs> that's a lot of damage. Like literally, hundred. Take my life. Even death does not stop your lust to kill one another. Such foolish creatures, you humans. Alright. I'll try both of these again. I just feel like, they, like these are like almost necessary. He's not affected by uh, water from it looks like it. Oh, not water, lightning. Maybe any magic potentially. I just have to physically, yeah. Have to physically attack this guy. Like, he's not tough, it's just can't use magic. It's good to know. Oh, uncomfortable. Please help us escape from this eternal suffering. Damn. Right, I'm gonna try to save my MP here if I can. Okay, we'll just attack. Even Marley's attacks will take him out. So they're not overly difficult. It's just wow. Seems you free some un undying slaves, such insolence. Oh, are you the magician? Asmanegis slash. Nope. You're the swordsman. I'm not ready for this. <laughs> I think that's what I'm trying to prepare for, for uh, right now. All right. I must admit I have not even dreamed you would find the courage to come here. Has Cyrus not been with you the last time, your fate would have been the same as all the others. But I'm sure you'd have fit right in with those skeletal servants of mine. Alright. Jab, bunge, throw away, what no. Alright, let's try... let's get Frog Heal a little bit. Magic did not do much. Can I figure like what a regular attack would do? Not too much here. Oh, regular attack's a lot better! <laughs> Probably... it's fine. Yeah, regular attacks work. I figure I'd move the menu up a little bit. I could try X Strike. Next time we get the opportunity with Chrono and Frog. Yeah, let's try this. I 
he's just targeting Brock. Like, you're gonna die. So I think regular attacks actually did more. You've some prowess for the first time in ages. Perhaps I'd best employ all of my own as well. And you without Cyrus. You've no hope. Lovely. Uh, let me heal Frog at least. I'm also trying to figure out like where exactly to put the uh, <laughs> pills. Alright, let's do Chrono, I think. Or actually Marley. Just make sure the healer's healed. <laughs> I'm gonna just keep using the extra and cure. I feel like the elemental attacks aren't gonna work that well, it's my problem. I mean, I could give it a try. It looks like the actual attacks are better. We'll, we'll give it a try. We'll try Sword Stream. So that's a new one. Not nice at all. Nope. Yeah, so he's like magic whatever. <laughs> he's purely physical attacks. Alright, let's do X Strike. I should have healed Barley. It's fine. She can at least take one more hit. Yeah. Like I said, one more hit. Gotta watch out for frog now. Uh, yeah, frog, frog, frog. He is tough. <laughs> Sir Slush. <laughs> Sir Slush a lot. Shush, shush, shush. How you doing, Magus? My mortal enemy. How you doing? How's your weak man? Yeah, that's not good. You ever just get hit by y'all? <laughs> yeah, a lot of damage. Actually, yeah, it does. I uh, just got home from my dad's. Nice. Oh, boy, well. Oh, we beat him. He's so slush, slush. Uh, unbelievable, but to fall fighting for Lord Magus. Just can't take your sword. There could be no greater honor. So I'm gonna die in this pose. Watch me. Oh, cool, I can. <laughs> I was wondering, like, can I take the sword? Hell yeah. All right, it does have massive man equipped. Cool. We fought well, Slash. Not nah, well enough. We could have done better. Don't want him to fight too well. That's pretty cool, though. I was wondering this entire time because I'm walking around. I'm like, I have this bat following me. I feel like this is like Magus's eyes, just like wandering around, like watching my every movement. And then like a fight occurs and he's just like, I'm out watching the distance. All right, I need to attack you. Are you like my castle? Eh, that's all right. It's a bit, uh, I uh, uh, guess, suppose a little gothic. It's not too, sh not too shabby. Yeah, some very nice candles. Another 
They're very flickery. I did learn about Frog's backstory before getting here, finally, though. Finding out that his name's actually Glenn. And he was kind of like trained and raised by Cyrus. In a way. Cyrus sacrificed himself to protect Glenn. Glenn got turned into a frog by Magus. Nice little backstory there. That was so sad though. Wait for it. I ended up going back to get Frog's magic before I got here. So we got into the cave and there's Frog's just like, wait, you're using magic? What the hell's going on? So I guess you had the option to actually go back, get Frog's magic, and then come back here. Which is actually kind of nice. That should be enough for now. But I keep trying to change my party up a little bit as I go. It's like sometimes I'm like using Robo and Luca. As soon as I got Isla last stream, I was like, let me try I think I use Luca again. I kept, do I want your treasure? Yes, you gotta turn into skeletons. Okay, but first, play with us, please, pretty please. I want to play. <laughs> All right, we'll shower with a stream of lava. Bit over kelp, that's fine. Should just use lightning, too, or ice water. It's fine. Yeah, I'll just do ice water. Steam version doesn't show enemy names. It shows them at the top. Like before I select the enemy, I'll mention it like where it says like 200G. I'll mention it there. That's about it. But there's like nothing barrier sphere? What the hell is that? Reduces magical damage by one third. It's not equipment, it's just an item. Okay. Interesting. Hey, gang. Yeah, these people are, uh... That's where I'll bury you. Jesus. Ah, okay, cool. Just blow up into, like, five enemies. It's great. That's what we all want. So, yeah, Gaia? Yeah, so, like, when I'm selecting the enemies, like, there are underlings, fire bats, uh... I had a name, but I just killed it. <laughs> yes, yeah, so they had the name listed there, but not anywhere else. The SNES version had a window at the bottom of the menus with a pure over it. Oh, interesting. I, feel, I really need to look back at uh, the SNES version just to be like, okay, how was this? Frog, you're safe. Oh no. That will not do at all. <laughs> Is there like gins or something? Underlings? Sorcerer. Alright. Close enough. Yeah, so they mentioned there's Slash, and then there's another one. It's like a magician that we have to fight next. Oh, it heals. All right, so that water attack's gonna be useless. That's a waste of MP. Good enough. These are not very tough. 
Or at least Marley leveled. This freaking bat. <laughs> Kronos, this is where you've been this since the fair. You had me worried sick. Like sick to death. <laughs> you've been very naughty. Ah, oh, okay. I think you'll have to die. That's fair. I think the only thing I don't like so much about this battle system is trying to select the enemy you're trying to attack. So I feel like it's not perfect. Like sometimes I'll try to attack an enemy or select an enemy, whether I'm using the control stick or the D-pad. I try to use the D-pad more often, at least for battling. But sometimes, even then, I'm like, over-selecting, I feel like. So it's not, it's definitely not perfect. That's definitely one of the enemies they were talking about. But also, just going into this castle in general, just stirring off with it, honestly. Uh, a bit ominous, I would say. Because it was just pure silence, and it's just people you're talking to. There's just nothing else. Made me extremely uncomfortable. They did a great job doing that. I should be a friendly person, though. The magician flee, I presume. <laughs> he doesn't even talk. He's gonna like, just go right into this. All right. So they mentioned jugglers. Steals MP. That was not fully. Where's the true? I am here, right here. Flea was with us all along. <laughs> you know, Flea's but always with you. There's always Flea's with you. Greetings, little green one. So I'm gonna start this battle with like no MP. Great. What's with her? She is a powerful magician. Do not lower your guard. Flea is not the mere woman she seems. Yes, yes, I'm a man after all, right? It's bad. That's a guy. <laughs> Thanks, Marley. Man or woman, that's all the same. Power is beauty, and I'm deliciously strong. Poor little froggy. Must be lonely now that Cyrus is gone. Now she kind of reminds me of Aloy. A little bit. Like Aloy maybe mixed with like the Gerudo girls from Ocarina of Time with like the hairstyle and everything. Anyway. <laughs> dude, that's a dude, dude. Dude. Right on. Uh, and to be turned into something so hideous, how dreadful. But since you've brought your new friends over to play, let me show you all a good time. Hey. Where are we going? Oh, ooh, ooh. that's actually pretty cool. All right, I need to get you restored. Can I wake you up? No. Also, just testing. Magic works. Okay. I'm trying to decide if I want to go with magic or just do regular attacks. Let's get frog healed. We'll try lightning. Frog's asleep again. <laughs> we'll do cleave. Uh, let's see. So I said uh, so that turn. Actually, I woke up frog, didn't I? I'll say, I don't think Cleve's doing very well. That's not doing too bad, but... Oh, do he went? Oh. <laughs> Answer's no. There's no difference. Yeah, I think the moment I have the opportunity to heal, I probably should in case Marley goes to sleep. 
I want to get binded? Fleas and magic? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Yeah, 100% gotta heal. I do extra. Cross slash an enemy? Oh, lovely. Alright, she's actually kind of tough. Compared to Slash. Um. Problem is his status effects. If you're not careful with them. That was a good hit. About slurping. <laughs> I was like, ah, I don't need to slurp yet. Now it's time to slurp. Um, you know what? We'll do extra. I think Frog can at least survive another attack. But I know it can probably take a couple more hits. Oh, we're good. Perfect. <laughs> GG's. But, but I'm so beautiful. Dude, Sam. Lord Magus. So what was that? Obtain the magic capsule. Neat. Uh, permanently raises magic by one. Right. Let's give that probably the... Uh, A crown. <laughs> Don't know why. We'll just do it. Bro. Bra. How you doing? As I try to navigate my menu. How you doing, mistake? How's your week been? Wow. Oh, jeez. You know, it's just a Monday. Is it? I thought it was like a Tuesday or something. Monday? Damn. Tuesday would be better. I guess I'll take a Monday. I've been good though. Uh, got my midterms done last week, so I don't have to worry about that. Worked a little bit today. Worked like a half day. Today? Not even that, we just worked a couple hours. And we still got like holiday pay along with it, but uh, worked like a little bit this morning. And it just did a lot of cleaning. Did a lot of spring cleaning. Feel great about that. Overall I'm doing pretty good. Today today has been a good day. As I try to Navigate. <laughs> I just got done cooking and cleaning. Uh, let's see here. My little uh, one second. I'll just do like two. <laughs> Here's my list. Says next up is shower and sleep. And the whole cycle begins again tomorrow, starting with work. A life to live. Speaking facts there. Yeah, you know, my schedule kind of just said haste. <laughs> Hello. So I just move faster. Have time between turns for allies. Sweet. That could actually be really good. I find the more Marley levels up, her support attacks are actually pretty very, very well. Like her magic and everything.
Yeah, for me, I had a, you know, I woke up, had a little work, schedule went into cleaning. I did a lot, I did like a spring cleaning today. I got rid of a lot of things I need to get rid of that I've been wanting to do. So I'm very happy with that. I pretty much got everything I needed done today. Oh, it's like I don't normally get much time off in between work and school and all that. So I might as well just use what the day I have to... Yeah, I was worried about that. Use the day I had to uh, clean up and get stuff around done around the house. So I was happy about that. Very weird that Battle Music actually just starts now. <laughs> I somehow accumulate shit I don't need or want. Where does it even come from? Yeah, actually, I got rid of... I don't know if y'all have ever seen it, but there's like an elliptical behind me. Or at least it used to be behind me. I got rid of it. <laughs> or if I got rid of it, I mean, I gave it to my brother. I just did not want it. Yeah, it's not so much because I don't use it. Or I didn't want it, it's more because I just don't use it. <laughs> it still kind of works. I just... I don't know. I feel like if I'm going to start exercising, I'm not going to be using that. It's not the best. I just, I just really want to get rid of it. Also, it wasn't in my mind. <laughs> uh, I had those fake flame light bulbs. I don't recall I'm running these. How <laughs> did they end up here? Why are they flaming? What's happening? <laughs> I'll trade you. I will honestly say you don't want the elliptical that I have. <laughs> it's not very good. Which is another reason why I want to get rid of it. It was like a very cheap, small little elliptical. It works, but it's also a bit squeaky when you try using it. Like, there's a bolt on there. No matter how tight you make it, you make it tight, works well, then after using it for a little bit, it just gets very squeaky and loose. And then you have to retighten it, squeak, stop, and then they begin again after a while. I got so tired of it. <laughs> I'm looking at the box, and I guess they're just normally light bulbs. Maybe the flames are unintended. It's just like inside the actual bulb. Are they kind of just like flame bulbs, maybe? Not so much light, but fire. Like they're, all, they're shaped like a light bulb. It's like in the bulb, but instead of light, it's just like a little flame. Like it just, it just flicks on. Sounds like a genius idea, by the way. Just saying. You know, just ever want to flick on your candles, just flip a switch. Be great. <laughs> I actually did finish. A I, be I pretty much finished Arceus Legends. <laughs> or Legends Arceus. Uh, over the weekend, too. Like I had Thursday and Friday were my midterms, and after that, I decided just to play the rest of it. Like, I got it done. And now I feel like I just want to catch them all. Which I actually almost have that done too. Not as bad as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> like I think I'm just going to spend like, some downtime during the rest of the week just either doing some schoolwork or completing the poker decks that I have, and then I'm pretty much good with the game. <laughs> I'm, I literally am about finished with them. Like, I kid you not. <laughs> oh, Ozzy's here. Nice. I beat the main story. I've been chipping away at the post-game stuff. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. I finally did the Wisps thing. <laughs> I spent a couple hours yesterday actually doing that. Just finding all the Wisps. I did that. I am <laughs> proud. <laughs> I go to all allies? Holy, hold up. Damn. He needs Marley. <laughs> Kidding. Where am I? That was a good heal. 
I want to complete the decks and the whips and then call it. That's where I'm kind of at. I don't really care about the verses. I feel like the verses where I'm like, whatever. I want to do the decks and the whips. And then maybe try shiny hunting. Like give them a try. And that's about it. But there's really not much else I have left in that game. <laughs> Uh, so you've made it. Slash. Flee. Dead. Pardon, Zazie, they cannot help you anymore. Fly eating tongue flicking. Oz. Ozzy's in a pickle. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I have five of the 28. Oh, the unknowns. Gotcha. I don't know how many I have. I might have like five or so. I have not been keeping count. That's another thing. I'm not doing that. <laughs> complete the coat Pokedex, complete all the quest stuff, and then I'm calling it. <laughs> Maybe that will be doing it like sometime down the road. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Ozzy's a pickle. <laughs> Do not escape us. King Mistro armor. It's my robe and armor. It is. If it needs a ruby vest, but you just get a robe made of mist. All right. Why? Okay. <laughs> Think I get it? Yeah, I get it. It's actually not that bad. Welcome. Uh, I think you need all 28 of the entry to be complete, so... It... Oh, is it really? Well, I guess we'll be doing that sometime this week. <laughs> Alright, go. Tame Dark Mail. Give that to Chrono, maybe. Wait. So magic defense goes up, but my physical defense goes down. Actually, might be better with... Yeah. Alright, we'll give it the frog. Go. Hehe, <laughs> not bad. How's this? I can go quicker. Rude. Go. Jeez. Alright, this is gonna be hard. Oh, okay. No, I deserve that one. Actually, didn't get hurt that bad. I'm proud of me. That wasn't that bad at all. That dude has the best grin on his face. He's so proud of this overly complicated room that a group of young adults are easily... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I love like meeting his uh, descendant in the future. Just being like, what happened? <laughs> what impossible. Or at least present day, I think it is. Tain Deathclaw. Come again. That's gotta be... Yeah, it's gotta be something for Robo. Who's gonna like, equip a Deathclaw? Yeah. Stone Arm too. Okay, yeah, I had a couple claws. Give you Ruby Best. Uh, okay. Just double checking everything. Cool. Don't remember this dude's lineage. It's been a hot minute. Yeah, because he has an ancestor during present day. Where he's like, how did, like, he's just in a random home. Wondering, like, how everything failed. Oh, whoops. Uh, can I climb down? Should I climb down? <laughs> no, we're not gonna climb down. <laughs> Am I climbing down? Like, should I be climbing down here? I feel like I should not be climbing down here. Just keep on climbing down. I'll try to save my MP here, though. I think this is my only complaint with this version. I'm not sure if I can actually get rid of bars, but like the health bar and everything underneath the characters. 
I'm not a fan of. Because I wish that bar was actually just on the actual... Uh... Okay. I like the actual like menu there on the bottom, right? Like with Chrono and Frog and all that. Like I wish it was there. Having it directly under the characters isn't working that well. <laughs> Unless you can actually disable it all, which would be kind of cool. Can I fight you? Fight. I don't know. I am kind of curious if I can disable it. Might be able to. I'm probably looking right at it, but that's fine. Yeah, it's fine. They were at the shelf at the bottom before. So I feel like I prefer that. Oh, these are the jugglers. Okay. And do attack and then do magic. They mentioned this while I was on my way here. Ah, okay, got it. Perfect. On my way here, someone's mentioning, oh yeah, by the way, you should probably uh, watch out for jugglers that go in between guarding against physical and magical attacks. So that's cool. Actually, really into that finally. I, I actually like that better though. This is bad. <laughs> I feel like I just fell into like a Zelda puzzle. Ow. Like I really want to use like a lightning or icy water. Kind of holding off. I do appreciate you can actually move the actual menu though, like during battle. Obviously sometimes you're gonna be like a little over it. <laughs> Lapis. Alright, I kinda figured there would be more. Carrier sphere shelter. Stores 200 HP to all party members. It's not bad at all. And right, what's this? Magic capsule. Just keep looking around. Okay, that might be it. Alright, that one I think I am going to give to Marley. We'll go left. This is a save. Okay. Actually, appreciate it. <laughs> I haven't saved in a while. One of these will get out of me. Save points are foes. We're not supposed to fight the save points. <laughs> save points are supposed to help us. What are they called? They don't even have a name. They give you actually a decent amount of experience points. Alright, I think that did it. Alright, so I have to figure out I'm gonna keep following. Oh my god. Well that worked. Uh go. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, that's close. Alright, so what's down then? Alright, it's just another enemy. I might as well just experiment with all of them. Yeah, seriously, they actually give you a decent amount. All right, we'll go save again. So 
so if I got this correct, I can go around here and then up. All right, that's kind of cheap. <laughs> I digress. Did he change it? All right, that now that's a dick move. <laughs> so where's the safe? Oh, that's a save point, but they get the heck out of your point. You just move everything around? Yep. That's good to know. Get it. Alright, dick move, man. <laughs> oh, this is actual save again. Cool. Should definitely have it next time. My thing is, once you get around that corner, is he just gonna run? That's lovely, like, he does not want to fight. <laughs> He's just like, I'm getting out of here. <laughs> Alright, we should have it this time. Right, right. Hi there. Get that cardio in. <laughs> Possible. Hey, we're gonna focus gold, pal. <laughs> and they can do flame roll. You know what? Respect. I know I plan this out. So I gotta do magic, physical. Oh, okay. <laughs> Are we fighting? <laughs> Rondolo, Rondolo, bow. I saw the name after I selected the attack, and that made me realize it's gonna go boom. <laughs> it's just gonna blow up. All right, let's go with Frog, actually. I just like him do that. We're getting up there, though. We're almost at the top, maybe. I'm sure we still got like another puzzle, but getting better. All right, how can we do this without blowing it up? Let's just use the line and see what happens. I think you have like no choice. Like you're taking damage regardless. That was my fault, I skipped through it. I think I just leveled up that with Frog. Yeah, well, we'll take the bomb with us. It's kind of hoping the bomb would also take out the enemy. <laughs> Figures is blowing up, so it didn't work. There's a lot of these guys. Okay. I think we're about to fight him here. Let's play it safe. Could recover some MP. We're finding something here. <laughs> Alright, just more of these guys. Alright, I'll just target one at a time. 
I was gonna say, do they have like the bone clubs? But I think that was them in the prehistoric time. A little different than the future. <laughs> or the past, past, future. So what do we have? We have like the future, which is like just destroyed. Present day. <laughs> then we have like the somewhat past and then like the past past. Yeah, the past is future future. <laughs> it pretty much sums it up. And right now we're currently in present day. Oh. Gotta fight a lot of these guys again. All right, <laughs> I'm feeling. Oh, that's gonna be annoying. You know what? I think I need to do this first, and then attack. And attack. Or not? Maybe not. Should attack one at a time. Or not. No, that worked. <laughs> Alright, so y'all hate physical. Do a little bit of ice here. Those are ninja birds. They really are. They are some annoying ninja birds, I tell you. It's birds. Do not want to stop. I will say Ozzy really likes all these uh, little like antics, I suppose. Lovely. All right, you have a plan. Let's use ice water. Just cycling them. Right. I figure I can just do physical attacks on them all now. Should be fine. Yeah. Especially if they all just attack Chrono. Just getting a counter attack them all. It's perfect. They don't even need to do anything. Oh, that's rude. I don't read, but I would read the few sentences in the comic about the those guys. Something tells me Ozzy's watched a lot of Rube Goldberg videos on YouTube. Makes you think of that. What? Impossible. You weren't supposed to make it this far. Surprise. Speed belt. Nice. Alright, so I'm assuming it's... Yeah, speed plus two. Whoa! As you get stars. Wait, hold up. What's that mean? What the hell does stars mean? I like ra the range band, but what does that mean? That just means like he's fast. Like very fast, maybe? I kind of want to try it. Oh, I can't get rid of that though. All right, let's wait. I really like the counter attack. Am I conflicted? I'm gonna do it. All right, so we're fighting regular. It's perfect. I did start attacking right away. 
bar is kind of going up fast. Yeah, I'm moving really fast. I really hope at the end of this, you you and the egg cracks over a frying pan. <laughs> Be perfect. Alright, I am actually going to unequip it. I, I like the rage band too much. this. Surprise Frog did not get hit. Dude, father should have That's okay. I was thinking like a shiv mixed it up a little bit there. <laughs> a lot of fighting on the way here, by the way. I'm very curious how tough these guys are going to be. Alright, let's do lightning too. And then... I thought about attacking the jugglers. <laughs> Wasn't entirely sure if I should have. Probably should have attacked them. I attacked them, just as I planned. <laughs> Oh, cool. Athenian water. Could use another one of these. All right, this is 100%. <laughs> I feel like we're definitely gonna fight him here. Uh, all right, we're mostly. Yeah, Marley would be fine. Can I grab the chest over here first? Thanks, appreciate it. Just stay put. All right, cool. I equipped anything. <laughs> I think I already have a couple magic scarves. Yeah, I do. A couple. Uh, I do have another misrobe. Anyone that equipped it besides uh, Marley? All right. I appreciate you letting me actually go around and actually grab the items, though. And I'm second guessing myself, so I'll heal again. Cool, let's do it. Okay, there we go. Gasping. Ozzy, your time is nigh. <laughs> Lord Magus. Should I finish summoning Lavos by now? I won't be defeated by you. I won't. No attack can pierce my barrier. I'm invincible. Barrier. Where are you aiming at you? I'm just, oh, oh. Alright, let's try... You know what would be really nice right here? You know, some, uh... It's some fire. Okay, I'm actually a little confused here. Wait, can I grab those hooks? Wait, hold up. Yeah. Missed me. Ooh, okay, got it. 
All right, let's do a heal. I wonder if he could actually somehow break his barrier. That'd be kind of cool. I didn't think you're aiming. <laughs> I was actually kind of thinking of that emote. <laughs> I was afraid I was gonna knock myself down, honestly. Uh, I'll, just, I'll keep it up here. <laughs> Please. Huh? Oh, the iron. Is he dead? That was a breeze. Time is our enemy now. We must hurry the Magus. I was a little afraid of that. I gotta go back. I was trying to decide like, which one's a heal, which one, well, which one's a save station and which one's not. I was kind of curious if I could actually somehow go back to the bottom floors and just find them. <laughs> Thank you, Lion. <laughs> Sir, I hope you have a good night as well. Your week's been going well. Have a good night for you, sir. It's <laughs> a lot of bats. Any more? I shut up. I was gonna say, was I jumping off there? It's <laughs> a lot of damage. I can, uh, I can lie. Dolls, mall, fire, low, layer, 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 layer. Yep. We doing, Magus? Cast open the gates of Libby Wicks, Betwicks, Heaven, and Hell Earth. I can talk. In exchange for the life of this world. Second one today. I guess it's you. Glenn's gonna tear you up. <laughs> Maybe. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, am I ready? I feel like I just want to make sure I have. I have enough like health and everything. All right, let's do it. Magus. Ah, oh, that frog of so many days ago. Are you? Probably not. I'm, I'm asking you, am I ready for you? Uh, how have you fared since last we met? And we you know, turned to a frog, uh, kind of learned, got a new sword. How you doing? Uh, well enough, I owe you my gratitude. This form has been a blessing in disguise without it. 
There are things I'd never have obtained. Ah, the massive moon that you've come for me. Let's hope no others interfere this time. Again, the bitter black winds begin to howl. I love this music right now. Oh. Come if it is death you seek. I don't know your weakness <laughs> or anything about you. All right, that wasn't that bad. Barrier change absorbs all the light. Magic defense reduced by massing. Oh, okay, that's actually. All right, so I need to use light. Right, or is it the opposite? Oh, that's right. It throws all about water. All right, so I need to use like Marley or Chrono, or one of them. Uh, let's heal. Hey, thanks for the follow, I appreciate it. How you doing? Sorry, it's a couple things happening. <laughs> uh, Bryce the baby dragon. Thank you, I appreciate it. Mm, so he's still healing from just water? Could have used... That's okay. Also, I didn't hear what just came up. <laughs> Definitely should have. I do have a Lapis if I need to use it. That's like a last case scenario. Alright, all the shadow. He might have gotten there. Whew. <laughs> Almost. The problem is I'm trying to keep up with all the messages that are coming up. So I'm like, okay, what's he absorbing now? All but water. All right, so use water, cure. So every time he takes a damage, his barrier changes. You have to figure out which is which. All but water. So I can use Marley again if I wanted to in an attack. I don't think about it. I might not want to. But yeah, I might want to heal Marley. Okay, we're good. Uh, yeah, let's see. Let's do heal. That didn't do much at all. All right, I think I get the idea of how to beat him. I just have to be a little bit smarter. Is it water? <laughs> that was light. Okay. Uh, okay, let's do... Uh, potions. Yeah, so every time we attack him, he just counters you instantly. Uh, okay. The fire? Alright, can't do anything in here. This is where I have like, another element that actually come into play. <laughs> Be helpful. I'm actually not doing that bad on MP right now. 
that's better. <laughs> like, I just need to, like, shoot them just to change the, uh, magical barrier that he's currently at. Alright, so he has water, so let's wait for Frog to attack next. Or actually, better yet. Sword stream? Let's do that. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> I probably should have healed. Uh, Frog uh, should be fine with one more hit. Still wouldn't risk it. Alright, I didn't actually pay attention. What's this thing next? <laughs> I healed the wrong person. Cool. Do you just do like... Okay. Saying like Superman there. <laughs> I hate the navigation, I swear in this. Like, just selecting characters to heal, I can't do it. That was too slow. So I'm thinking everyone but Chrono? Yeah. Just heal someone. I think I might be dead. Uh, let's get you up. I can't navigate this menu. <laughs> I'm done. The fucking menu beat me. <laughs> also, this does not look good. Cool. Guess that that happened. <laughs> I'm infuriated with that. <laughs> the menu beat me. My problem is like when I want to select stuff, it like auto pursues on me all the time. So when I go to like frog, press left on frog, but then like immediately goes to the next character after I select that character. So it's like I have to like lightly touch it. I swear I don't have heavy fingers, but like, come on. It's like constant. It did well up until he did that move with like the Superman thing. <laughs> like the the crystal with uh whatchamacallit. It's been a while since I watched that movie. You know, like they fly in space and all that jazz. I can't think of that, I don't know why. It's been a while since I've seen it. You know, the, the, like you'll see. Like, he doesn't attack where, like, this big space-looking triangle comes up and just hits everyone for, like, over 200 damage. And it's easy to navigate around. Like, I can do it. Problem is, I'm trying to get to the next window to do the heal that I need. And every single time I do that, it doesn't navigate properly. I know I could win. Alright, I think I should attack with Frog first. All the water, cool. I felt I did feel very prepared for that battle. 
I mean, I felt like it went very well. Up until it didn't. <laughs> I am kind of wondering how much of... I'm just trying to think to do. <laughs> and trying to remember what type of attack I can use. Water. And might be in trouble. Say me like seventy something. All right, that's cheap. <laughs> I'm about to get a, get a heal and let's do a quick strike on you. God freaking damn it! I can't, I don't understand the navigation on this. Like, anytime I have to do heals, I just don't get it. Alright, I gotta figure out what your weakness is this time. Shat, don't have that. It might be better having me off, like, another character that isn't, like, Marley. I thought because of the heals, just the abilities. Like if I can use like a fire or a shadow, just as like a backup. It's kind of nice to have. Definitely winnable. Or it feels winnable. <laughs> I'm like slowly working through this menu. Is it lightning? Oh, I should have read. <laughs> I think it was water. Oh, it was lightning. Cool. All the fire. Right. I wonder how the magic defense actually works. So I clearly can't. I'm like, I know I have a heal coming. I think I actually prefer using Cure, though. Because I mean, heal will keep me alive for a little bit, but it's not great. I feel like I'm trying to plan this out. Okay, I might don't change anything, please. <laughs> You know what? Let's try this out. Use Ice Sword. Alright, that, that was actually pretty good. I should probably should be doing that way more often. Yeah. 
Can I do it again? Oh, it's doing the thing. All right. Again. <laughs> I'm getting my heels in real quick. I can. Thank you. It's actually kind of weird when they do ice sword. This thing doesn't change. Like it's barrier? Interesting. Alright, it's going for the kill. <laughs> Alright, if I wait for Chrono, I think I'm gonna try to do Ice Sword again. Uh, where you at? Yeah, he's gonna do that thing again. Actually, it's not a bad strategy here. If it's if it just stays water, haste is actually a pretty good idea. <laughs> Cause he just gets it so quick. If I can just keep lowering his magic defense. Now I kind of want to use haste again, but I want to get it on frog. If I can potentially... Or actually even on Marley. I don't know how many people I can get haste on. I can get on everyone. And I do it. Hmm. We won. Alright, that actually ended up working. I don't know why his thing didn't change with Ice Sword. I guess it was only like magic attacks? Your skill with the Master Moon is that great already. Question? <laughs> What's that? Could it be Lavos? No, he mustn't awaken from a slumber yet. Awaken, you just created him, didn't you? Fools, I but summoned him. He has dwelt within the earth for aeons, absorbing the land's energy and growing even stronger. What? Was this energy in the air? A gate? You, if, it had, if you had not interfered. Chrono. Uh-oh. Okay. Chrono, are you still sleeping? What the fuck is happening? <laughs> Dear me, I forgot how beautiful- what? Chrono, 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 Chrono. Yeah, we get that way. Wait, am I supposed to wake? Was he just dreaming? I mean, I got. I mean, I guess I was. Yeah. Anyway, Isla. Isla, I want to see Chrono go Mystic Mountain. You there, fall down, hurt. Uh, I like carry back up. I guess. Big frog present for Isla E. <laughs> I was wondering if I get Isla, you'll be like, why is there a frog? Perish the thought of what, but of what of the pale faced man in the cape? Was he not with us? 
Now only find you. Cape one more TC. <laughs> so he has flood. But if Magusin create Lavos, then where did it come from? Lavos, you no worry now, you rest hurt bad. So it kind of just threw us back into the prehistoric time. Uh, Chrono okay now. Isla busy. Try find La Ruba village. Find village, find reptites together. Big fight, last fight. Beat all reptites or reptites beat us all. Kino. Wait, where was, I, I actually it's that. <laughs> Northwood fire. Burn, big burn. Supposed to go north. <laughs> Magus has left the building. Magus, where are you going? <laughs> okay, so in a way, in a way, technically losing there was actually the good thing to do. Because losing that battle, at least you could control Lavos. And not just let Lavos let loose. <laughs> so, in, in hindsight, at least he would have been able to control. Uh, he messed things up. He messed things up. There's a lot of things I messed up. All right. So they tell us I gotta go north. I just want to make sure. Chief, look, La Laruba Village Northwood. Chief, okay. All right. So yeah, we gotta go north. Train your new weapon. Go see. Oh, wait, what? Okay, I'll take that. That's a fun fight, though. It's extremely difficult. Uh, give me six. Wait. Dreamstone gun? <laughs> yes. Alright, see what else we can get. Let's do pedal with Dreamstone Bow. Yes. Do pedal with Feather. Magma hand. Sure. E. Fang with Feather. Ruby vest. I already have that. Nah, that's whatever. All right, so I can at least equip a new bow on Marley. Very good bow. And then on Luca, I think it was. Dreamstone gun. That's about all I can do. Vest is weak. Did she equip that? No. She can, but. That good. And then back my hand. All right, cool. Well, that was a lot that just happened. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, that's about all I got. Just a bunch of yas. All right, so we're supposed to go to the North Wood. North Woods Forest. Here? I didn't even see this before. Rib mag. Reptites take Kino. Reptites kill all tri stop reptites. What do now? Reptites follow Isla. Isla, bad luck. People fight. Reptites kill all. You fight so reptites mad. Isla, this is your fault. Look at village. Reptites follow you, now village ruined. Isla, sorry. Reptite strong, live long before us, so we hide. But Isla say fight together. Isla still say fight now. Isla alive, Isla fight. Win, live, lose, die, that rule, no one can change rule. Old man breathe, but dead inside. Isla strong, so make big talk. We not strong. Now, strong. Fight, get more strong. 
Isla help, but now need Dactyle. Give Dactyle. Dactyle. Go Tyrano Lair. <laughs> Tyrano Lair Reptite Castle. Castle. Danger, even Isla danger. Isla won't die. No. Want live, so go. Isla be okay. Give Dactyle. I'm comprehending everything. <laughs> yes, give Dactyle. Elder Tell Keeper, so go Dactyle Nest. Isla be careful. Elder Big Help. Alright, so I guess we're finally going to that nest that I've been to like I don't know how many times. You take care, Isla. I have been to this nest I don't know how many times and never did anything here. So I guess it's kind of like a relief a little bit to be like I can finally go here and do something. I do honestly love frogs, not even phased by this. He's just like, whatever, I'm in prehistoric times now. Let's just live with it. I'm actually gonna do real quick. I'm actually gonna take a quick BRB and just stretch. Um, if anyone needs to get water, food, drinks, whatever you gotta do, feel free. Um, I'll be back in like five minutes. It's not gonna be a long one, um, like usual. But I figured just stretch, get some water, whatever you gotta do, and then when we get back, we'll continue and we'll go from there. So, all right, I'll be right back, guys. Welcome back. <laughs> Hope everyone had a good break. Uh, we're gonna go a bit more, and that's about all I got. <laughs> Alright, I gotta climb back. There we go. So these enemies are definitely a lot easier than from I remember. <laughs> Last time we were getting obliterated by these Well, not obliterated, but they definitely took a while to beat up. They were gr a great way to level up early game. I'll say that. I'm thinking once I get through the Dactyle S, I guess singing, I have to go to like the top of it, like I usually do. Like the last couple times I was here, I had to go to the very top. Uh, yeah, I'll take those guys on. I think over here, just trying to grab the rock. That's what I was worried about. So I guess unless we actually take it out. It's just gonna keep throwing the rock guys. Chrono learned rays, like from the dead type of rays. <laughs> yep. 
wonder how that works. Like how much HP are they gonna get back when they raise them up? I guess it would be like the same as like a team or maybe like, like all the way, but close. Sacred counter. Rocks aren't too bad. But to me, I can't decide like, whether or not I just want to. Finish off the rod, like the sh whatever they're called. They call shits. <laughs> like S C H I T. Yeah. <laughs> Taking them out or the great apes. Like they're from like the Wizard of Oz. Man. They were near the top. Yeah. Finally, something up here. <laughs> I'm gonna heal real quick. <laughs> and then we'll go say hi. Crow! Better not even think about going without us. The Jurassic World sequel start, start taking notes. No, Tyranno Lair Danger. You no know, come, maybe I'll die. We just dealt with Magus. We can deal with anything. Alright. If it's that dangerous, we definitely can't let you go alone. You've done a lot for us, Isla. Now it's payback time. Right, Corona? Isla have good friend. Come on, Isla. Let's go to the Tyranno Lair. Tyranno Lair. Probably saying that properly. Alright, so we have Isla. Um I think I kinda wanna bring Frog. <laughs> I mean, Frog does have heal and stuff. Like, his heals aren't as great as Marley's. Which I did feel a little spoiled over. I feel like his heals are good enough. Isla's definitely 100% like all physical attacks. Or I could bring Luca. I haven't used Luca in a while. Actually, Luca might be bad because I have no heal losers then. Oh no, I like and heal, but she, uh, what well, she looks like, kiss or something like that. We'll go frog. I just like frog. <laughs> I like frog and I like robo. I like a lot of the team. Yeah, another anime cutscene. Actually flying. <laughs> should we tell them they should probably be sitting down, not standing on the pterodactyls, kind of like uh, that they're surfing on them, just gliding on there like a surfboard, flying in the air. That'll be. Uh, where am I? Can I just go full circle? Oh, hold up. 
and loops. Okay. That throws me off. Alright, so it was like top right. Where is this place? Yeah, it's here. Alright. Terrano layer. Does Magus have another layer here? Someone has another layer here. Yeah, how long has it been? Oh, I know, there was that one enemy. The Isle was dealing with that was here. Get the name of It's kind of like an evil looking. Piccolo looking thing. Not Piccolo. Arshan. <laughs> Frog learned aerial strike. Slurp kiss. It's foul. <laughs> Lightning rod Doltek. Alright, so kiss lightly heals. Slurp kiss. Heals all allies and restores stats. Well, I mean, at least it's good. Sort of. Can I go in the mouth? Awesome. open up y'all free free all right let's check it out uh there's nothing it's just a cell cool now, how is i like to do this all by herself yeah i'm sure she can get through most of it but about to have a feast and you're about to be the roast beast <laughs> it's the apes and frog don't forget frog it's kind of rude calling this beast and there's a frog there i think so Myself, <laughs> like, no, never mind. Let's see. Yeah, I heal. Yeah, hello. Do you want out? Isla, oh, it's Kino. Okay. Kino, move back. Isla, save Kino. The switch. I'm through. Hmm. <clears throat> Kino, sorry. All Kino's fault. It's okay. Kino, take all La Ruba person run. What Isla do? Strong live, weak die. Isla, go be strong. Kino, go too. Kino, no come. Isla die, Kino, new Ioka chief. Isla. Should probably open the gate. Okay. So there's a switch right there. <laughs> Isla strong, no lose. Kino, no. Kino, show you something. Follow Kino.
I'll move too fast. I gotta open the other door. Yeah. Poor mouth. Uh, you strong, Kino weak, Kino jealous. Bye, Kino. Alright then. So I'm sure that was a little bassy, but it sounded nice. I'm so real, I'm like, I'm about to die. your weakness like lightning or something just remembering yeah that's my fault am i like, taking these hits i'm like very confused my how is it still alive The more I go through here, though, the more I realize I probably should have grabbed up maybe an actual healer. <laughs> like a proper healer, maybe? Still doing good, but, you know. Step on the switches. I've just dropped them both. God damn it. <laughs> I'm wondering if I should just fall through them. Oh. It's a door. Alright, that would make sense. Okay, so not too bad here. Hopefully I just didn't jinx myself. So he just blow himself up? <laughs> That's what I get for walking back and forth. <laughs> she just went straight through. That's on me. I wanted to check the corner out. Actually, good question. Do I have anything for Isle? She's only fight Bearfest. Like equipment wise. I don't think she ever equips anything. She do speed. I was wondering, how can I pass can I make her? I broke an egg. <laughs> we stuck in jail? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, so that, that was incorrect. Oh, right, again. I just figured if I'm here, I might as well just fight him. 
as I just throw all the enemies at me. Overall, we're not doing too, too bad. Uh, uh, I want to go both directions. That's my problem. I do want to go back to the other egg and check the other one out. This is gonna suck. <laughs> okay, not as bad as I thought I was gonna be. I thought I was gonna end up like falling through one of the holes. I feel like it's not gonna be perfect. I'm thinking maybe attack that guy first, but at this point, I just want to take out a little dinosaur friend here. Yeah, we can take him out. <laughs> so weird, like you attack him, he just attacks his end himself. Maybe like that's his weakness? Just do a physical attack on him, he just throws it. Throws everything at you. There's way too many of those eggs. I don't know, know what just happened. Obtain the potion. Oh. That's so weird. Oh. I mean, we got the way out, but I don't want the way out yet. Walk around. Nope. Maybe? Nope. On the contrary. Not that way. Uh, let's get Tricera or what now? <laughs> oh, it's a helmet. Arrow. Oh, I'll equip it. So yeah, Tricera what now? Tricera Topper. Nice. Actually, you know what I'm probably missing? I th could think about going back and doing. Okay, we got the Athenian water. I want to get that last egg. Don't know how. I'm trying to think of other ways I have not gone yet. Very confusing. <laughs> I'm gonna get over there and go down. I wonder if there's like something on the walls. That's kind of weird. Just go through through. I 
I want to get to that last one up here. I want the egg. Ooh, got it. Bez. Oh. Get the armor though, that's good. Alright, we'll give it to Viola. So they give the dark male the frog. Alright, let's get out of here. I was wondering, I'm like, what is that? Slot gate. Trying to get to. There you go. <laughs> Can I get to both of the Vulcanites? So I see what they're doing. Like, if you hit those Vulcanites, they'll attack the opposite. Unless I kill them. <laughs> Unless you kill them. <laughs> They will attack the other enemy. It is smart to actually take them out first. Either they'll live or they'll attack everyone else. So win. Boulder toss. Nice. Falcon strike. So, actually, now that I think about it, Isla doesn't have any magical abilities, like, within her, right? So what would she get? Like, Shadow? Dark, maybe? Because she has no element linked to her. Looking at the other screen. Oh, it's going to be bad. Go left. <laughs> well, I mean, it worked. So I'll take it. Alright, so I think the strategy here is use lightning, gum shock, attack the volcano, vulcanite, whatever. And let it, yeah, that'll work. He's just shocked. He's just shocked about everything around him. His life. Everything. Oh, whoops. Alright, we're good. Maybe. Thinking I might have opened the main gate. Yeah. Hello there. We are getting those items again, like feathers and everything. So I can at least trade those in uh, at some point. You use one of the mini ethers. Yeah. Oh, you again. This bowl. Looking for Izela? She's just through here. Okay, can I go? Oh, thanks. <laughs> I was wondering if I can go. All right, thanks. Appreciate it. Um, now I'm actually kind of thinking I should have went to that one door first. The one I, the one I missed, I kind of fell through. I guess I'll just still just go through here, but maybe I can go back and find that before I get out of here. I 
Alright, I was kind of figuring he's going to be like, yo, where are you going? <laughs> Hold it. When I said she's through here, I meant you gotta get through me first. What do you think I was flexing my muscles and looking all intimidating for? That's what I got figured. Alright, let's do it. You hate electricity too? I'm trying to remember what you hate. I could do lightning rod. Defense boosted when attacked. Alright, that's good enough. Alright, maybe we should use ALA as like a support in this battle of this, right? Or only attack when the defense is lowered? At this point, is when he's lightning grab. That looks so cool. Searing so almost does a thousand damage. That's all I need to do. It's lightning grab, like, consistently. Oh, I forgot about that part. Okay, never mind. Not consistently. I mean, I could get him out. Thousand percent lightning rods amazing for this battle. But I still want to make sure I'm like keep myself alive. Like when he does uh the discharge attack, that's what I'm most concerned with. Oh well, I'm not even concerned at all, it's dead. So overall, that was pretty good. <laughs> that was a lot. <laughs> That's why I mean with these characters, it's like you don't have the best heals, like recovery wise, but if I at least use the items properly, maybe if, if I needed to, and then use whatever abilities they have, like it works pretty well. <laughs> It'll work out. Gotta be smart with it. All right, well, we're almost level thirty. That's neat. <clears throat> yeah, that was the character I was looking for at Zayla. I kept thinking of the name of my crew. <laughs> So we gotta take out the main bad that gets in this timeline. Which I'm like end up all trying to work together to in the end. I'm gonna go both ways. I'm gonna go through the other one. I think the middle area is probably where I need to go. I think this way will bring me through the other gate that I missed. Or not. Or not at all. Uh, let's do lightning too. It's like you think so, and it's, then it's not at all. Lovely. 
Come on. I didn't. Alright. <laughs> yeah, that's how we're gonna do it. <laughs> so I figure I could just like walk forward and walk in between them. For some reason, like immediately need to go right. Now I keep forgetting to use the freaking shelters. It's really a save point here. So I keep coming here and I'm like, let me use everything else. But let's use a shelter. I always forget about them. Oh, thanks. You now maybe, oh, okay. I was just saying, maybe I don't need to get through the uh, other passage. This was probably locked then. I didn't even realize. Good to know. Oh no, just more. No biggie. Azala, whatever. Uh, at last, a final confrontation. It was but a matter of time. Will it be reptites who inherit the earth or you soft skinned apes? Oh, that's cute. He's so cool. How you doing? How's the, <laughs> how's the unknown catching going? Did you finish the game, by the way? Hope you're doing well. Hope everything went well with the papers. Well, you told me it went well. It went well. It went great. I'm glad to hear that. Ha. <laughs> great. It's always good to see you. Uh, strong live, weak die, I'll just fight. Fair. Hear that lovely voice? No. <laughs> You'll soon be hearing more of it than you'd ever wish. Lovely. I submitted my paper last night and then she extended the deadline for tonight. I was like, cool, cool, guess this means extra pokey time. <laughs> Isn't that great? They just give you that extra time to just be like, you know what? You might need an extra day to get it done. Just, just take it. That's awesome though, at least you get extra pokey time. Yeah, my job decided that we were going to work a couple hours today at home. So at least I didn't have to go into the office. I have to go tomorrow, but it was kind of nice though. Kind of like half a day and then I just cleaned up today. That's all I did. It's very relaxing. <laughs> be friendly can i just say this wall climbing cat monster that i just had <laughs> is both horror and an absolute delight <laughs> okay i get what you mean <laughs> it ain't all too bad 
I I'm glad you got that wall climbing cat monster though. <laughs> Half a day of relax. Yeah, pretty much. No, did you, she ended up giving us random hours to work and I ended up having to work the morning still. But I worked until like 11.30 and then literally like 11.30 onward, I've been off. So I decided to actually, I cleaned, I did some cooking, I made some oatmeal for the week. And then I decided to actually get started on my schoolwork this week because I just wanted to be so responsible. Just being a responsible lovey dovey. So I decided to look at my assignments and we have like a 55 quiz thing that I had to do. I decided just to do it today. So I got it done already. I have like a couple labs to do and then I have to get started on like a final project. School work, work, exactly. I decided just to be responsible. It's very lovely. The fuck is that? I'm, I'm gonna go. <laughs> Am I healed? Responsible. Blah. That's a big damnable red star. So it's better here. And it's blocking something. Or what? Fall, why don't you? Stained Red Earth. I wonder if the stars actually laugh at us. Even should it prove our fate to die, we will not relinquish this world to the likes of you. This black tyranno will have the honor of wiping you filthy apes from existence forever. That's just so fluff. This is a big, it's a big, big tyranno. <laughs> Guessing the hate lightning? your weakness oh hmm yeah this is a big old one I think I have to actually attack uh what's his face the, uh, yeah what do you hate micro attacks I don't know summons fourth boulder okay cool let's throw the freaking boulder Every time I stop paying attention, these wild pokies be attacking me. Literally. <laughs> it's all the time. Especially the blade Paris. I think with Paris is. Oh, well, I got you. Oh, damn, I actually did a lot. Finally got your turret week? Hell yeah. I actually finished all the requests today. <laughs> I had to double check to make sure I might do it. Get them all done. But that, that was my goal. It took a while. I also caught like three Pikachus today with all of you. Oh, Stop it. All the West Pred. Thank you. It took forever. <laughs> I decided to sit aside my evening uh, yesterday. I'm just like, I just want to do it all. <sighs> See how long it would take. It took a couple hours, <laughs> but I did get them all. Believe it. Well, it's kind of weird because I went to like some areas and I already had like a big chunk of them somehow. And then I go into the other areas where it's like, oh, you still have like another. 15 more to go. Oh my god, okay, great. <laughs> Turn down my volume. <laughs> Can we talk about how the ridiculous. 
about the ridiculous places that you find the unknowns. Oh, I just have all the whips left here. Okay. <laughs> exactly. Wait, who's weak? Oh, Isla. Four. I'm actually a little worried about that. Sometimes I would just walk into a cave and randomly find one, just like right in the ceiling. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. Other times I would. Um, walk into like grass and it's just randomly slinging grass. I'm just like, cool, great. Did I toss him? Hey, where'd you go? They really are sneaky. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Maybe. So I tossed him off the screen. <laughs> oh, I think I'm in trouble. I healed just to make sure. I'm gonna get hit here. Friendliest alphabet monsters. Hey, <laughs> oh, we're good. I was expecting a lot worse. I'm not sure if we talked about this. Can it be like alphabet soup version of unknowns? Are there ever? <laughs> it's somewhat like this. Yeah. I would also like it. <laughs> Sounds awesome. Sounds like a solid money-making scheme. Shocked into those and on already. I'm trying to remember if they had it like, when we were younger. Because we were like Johto? Yeah. Or even unknown cereal. <laughs> Anything. <laughs> I mean, if we've had Pokemon cereal. I, I do know that. Falcon Strike? Uh, Thunder Chomp. Do that. Unknown <laughs> SpaghettiOs, yeah! <laughs> that sounds awesome. I think this guy has a unlimited amount of HP. He doesn't, but feels like it. Oh, 
What is this, this nasal evolution thing though? Who designed it? I can't even say. Even the type typing with it's a little weird. So what is it like? Poison fighting? I was expecting it to be like dark fighting or something like that. It's like, nope, it's poison. That it throws me off completely. I figured it'd be something like a crow crown or something like that. Okay, you're out of MP. Uh, crap. Uh, can I do anything? Okay, we're one. We have MP there. No, it can't be. Could the heavens truly have sided with the apes? Listen, prime apes, and let it be known for all time, we reptites fought proudly to the bitter end. Island, no. First, a great fiery stone will crash to the earth. Its flames will soon spread to scorch every corner of the land. Then the chill will begin to creep across the blackened plains, ushering in a long, cruel age of ice and snow. A fitting end to our age, indeed. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Time about the end of the world. <laughs> Lavas. people word la I mean fire votes me big big old fire <laughs> Isla Kino hurry lavos fall soon all right dactyle you know, hurry. Isla, what you do? Come, Azela, come. No, this is the will of the earth. Isla, hurry. Azela. Isla, not forget. Take. What take? Take care of this world. <laughs> Please. It is very lit. Lavos was not spawned by Magus that far from the heavens and so long ago. Very sweating. You like a little towel. Lavos huge. Chrono fight that? Wait, are we the little blue dots in the bottom there? <laughs> Chrono, we place we go place Lavos fall. Or right, we're the little dots. Left to its own devices, the creature will burrow deep into the earth. Best defeat it now. Oh, uh... 
Because present day, it comes out of the ground, right? And kills everything. I think. If I recall from that video. Anyway. That was fun. Why have I not used my shelters? That's <laughs> ah, too late. Alright, well, that was fun. Where are we at? Let's check this out. A gate. Lavos fast, deep under earth now. Might Lavos be the source of these? The one in Magus's keep was immense. What wrong, Chrono? Want to fight Lavos? Go here. No. Okay. Don't know if this would be the right thing to do, but we'll check it out. So where have we come? Chrono, where is this place? Twelve hundred BC. Oh, twelve thousand BC. Sorry. So we're still in the past. <laughs> Excellent question. So now it's some time, I guess, after everything froze over. Terra Cave. What is that? <laughs> Chrono, what the fuck now? <laughs> there was a village. I didn't want to go to it yet. <laughs> okay. Guess we'll check out... Uh, uh, yeah, this. We can. Skyway. Okay. Sure. We're in the sky. <laughs> All right, uh, let's check this out. We have these little huts, maybe transport you to island to island. It's a bridge, yeah. And Hansa. I feel like Lila's like, what is happening? <laughs> this is the magic kingdom of Zeal, where dreams can be made reality. And nothing in this world comes free. There's always a price to be paid. Welcome to an Enhanza, Zeal's city of dreams. We seek enlightenment within the bliss of sleep. You are not of us, are you? Uh, makes you think that. I just wanted to read a book and it just, <laughs> it just burns up. <laughs> Story of my life. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Here, we just read a textbook and then all of a sudden it just burns up. I wish. Back to life, back to reality. Just like, ah, oh, yeah, burn it all. All right. Uh, you are most unusual visitors. Am I waking or is this a, but a continuation of my dream? A continuation of my dream. I can read. Listen, we got a guy with spiky red hair, a frog, and Someone from 65 million BC walking into this place. It's totally normal. Regardless of that, I welcome you to Zeal. Her Majesty Queen Zeal rules this magic kingdom. She is without peer and beauty of grace. Seems fine. Yeah. 
said the queen. Hello. We are prosperity to her majesty the queen. After the king died, she encouraged the development of our kingdom's magical prowess, which has led to the great advancements. Z. Uh, the queen has sealed away the great elemental weapons and armors forged them. Forged with the power of the sun and the shrine to the north. You can see his entrance on the northern continent, but no one's allowed inside it. That. Yeah, where is this? I want weapons. Ah, uh, yes, the wonderful advancements of our civilization. The wheel, fire, doors, and Z. <laughs> Just sleep. <laughs> the door to the northern shrine is sealed by a powerful force. Even we, the land ones, lack the means to open it. So we ain't chosen. Uh, welcome. If you do business, what do you sell? I should have a lot to sell, probably. <laughs> Crimson Blade, you know. I have a lot. <laughs> Do I spend my money? No. <laughs> Actually, I really should. It's like 50 votes. Yeah, we're good. I mean, <laughs> they can help me catch some solid Z's. I'm all for it. <laughs> okay, I have a quick pokey question. Sure. Uh, what's the deal with these satchels and why do people keep losing them? Like, please take care of your prolonging. <laughs> Thank you. Have you ever blacked out yet, so called? Like, have you ever fainted in the wild? So, the satchels you're finding are from other players that have fainted. So if you find them and then go to lost and found, you get merit points. And then those points you can use toward getting items in like Jubilife. Once, okay. So if you go to your bag and then like after the save icon, there's like that lost and found section, it'll list satchels and it'll show yours too. So since you Die or you blacked out once. Uh, one of your satchels are out there and someone can find it. And if someone does find your satchel, you'll get your belongings back. That's until someone finds one. I started fainting a lot near the end of the game. I probably have like seven or eight satchels somewhere. I've never gotten them back. But yeah, once someone finds your satchel, you'll get your stuff back. Whenever that happens. <laughs> I did the same thing. The very first area I had a white weird deer. The, or a certain deer. And I decided to just jump off the cliff just to see if I take fall damage. Turns out you black out if you fall fast fall enough. Hundred percent did the same thing. That was fun. No one has found my satchels and my mom is going to stop giving me my money. I will starve. Please help. Fend for yourself in the wild. Boy. <laughs> it turns out you're not gravity proof. Who would have thought? Figured my legs could take the landing. Or at least my deer. Deer just jumps onto the ground. You're not taking damage. The deer's taking the damage. Why would I take damage? I'm fine. What? Because my butt just landed very hard. Uh, see, it is very easy to s <laughs> see. It is very easy to see if I am not. I am me, because my in-game name is so call. Well, mine's Jason. So I feel like mine's very easy to figure out who I am. It's my alias. I don't think you lose a satchel when you die during a noble fight, though, which is a uh, good. Oh, I didn't know that. This <laughs> is like, I never lost one. Um, humble brag. That's cool. I actually didn't know that. Oh, wait, no. Never mind. 
but I have no idea who these lovely strangers who are whose belongings I keep finding. <laughs> Good to know. Yeah, they're... Yeah. No, I... I... Yeah, I have to. <laughs> yeah, so if you, like, if you look at your bag and if there's like a yellow exclamation mark, that means either someone found your satchel or you have a satchel you can like collect stuff from. So it's like one of those two. I love collecting drop satchels. Got thousands, thousands of points from doing that. <laughs> Trav killing it over here. I started doing it more only recently, just because like I've been exploring a lot more and I'm just happen to find them. So it's like, might as well. <laughs> 3,200 points, nice. Has names aren't in English, so no idea who they are most of the time. Some of them are from my friend list, though, I think. Oh, that's cool. We find any of mine. <laughs> Let me know. Uh, I miss that whole thing. Uh, what? An animal for eat? Tastes good? <laughs> I was like, can I eat your cat? Thanks. The black wind howl. Once among you, one among you will surely say one. No, wait. One among you will shortly perish. Young one, of what do you speak? It's probably me. <laughs> I do not know what this portends, but I did not like the sound of that at all. Strange boy, but not bad boy. Bad boy. I'm a bad person, I really pick them up. <laughs> Just ignore them. I like, ah, you deserve it. <laughs> I don't want no merits. Yeah, I was wondering if these people, if these were people I knew or random people. Gotcha. So I guess, I guess this is a mix of both? I haven't found anyone from my friend list yet. Uh, this is a font of recovery. A font of recovery? Rest your weird mind and body within Traveler. Sure. Healing his leather O. Alright, healed. Alright, cool. I wonder what's within the Northern Shrine. No doubt the key to unlock its seal is held at the palace, but entry there is strictly forbidden in the name of Her Majesty the Queen. Did she just like, let me in? The Queen's Palace sits at the heart of her kingdom. She watches over all of our world from its high vantage point. It's because of that we can sleep our days away in peace. Okay, now this one's just blowing wind. Cool. I still need to finish Arceus. I'm in the last area, but I got distracted with another game. <laughs> it's all good. I, I just finished it this weekend. <laughs> it's a fun game to just play casually or even burn through. Depends. I, I went through a couple weeks of just playing very casually and then I would just have like one or two random weekends where I just like burn through it. But it's fun. A font of recovery, but the kerning is sort of jacked. <laughs> Is a font sir for Sans <laughs> Comic Sans. It's, uh, it's definitely not Times New Roman, I can tell you that much. Right now, I am the Pokemon legend. <laughs> now, like, uh, what's his face going? Like, I am the captain now. Like, I'm the Pokemon legend now. I'm the legend. Uh, the city of Kajar? The high sea of magical research lies on the edge of the western continent. There's just someone throwing so many things at me. The airship, the black bird, is maintained there as well. Z. Does everyone just love sleeping here? I am the Pokemon Legend. This is my ship. <laughs> so that voice of the black wind was blowing. So maybe it was talking about the black bird? There's just water coming out of this book. <laughs> what is happening? I think it's water. Either that or it's just, uh, I don't even know. It's just the floodgates. It's just going, it's going everywhere. I'm just gotta close it. What are you doing? The world you see with your eyes may well differ completely from the one I see with mine. 
There are many different worlds as there are observers. Never assume that only those things which you can see or touch are real. Okay. I've been out of Pokemon for so long. Every time a new one pops up, I'm like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> I had that a lot with this one. I was so happy with it. <laughs> it's definitely milk. Yeah. It's a 2% milk. It's popping out of the book. Z, a uh, Z. Truth exists in dreams. The world exists in me. Z. Do you believe it's just things as fate? Do you think it's possible our lives are predetermined? Well. Well, do we? That's none of your business. You know, fate's none of your business sometimes. <laughs> Do I think my fate's predetermined? It's not your business. I guess he didn't like that answer. I guess we'll talk to him again. Wait, <laughs> can I talk to him again? Guess not. All right. That's actually kind of mean. <laughs> I was kind of hoping I could go, like, go through each answer. <laughs> He's just like, oh, fuck you then. <laughs> yeah, what are you doing? I am Doreen. Seek the hidden path and open the doors of knowledge, each in turn. I like this dancing pig man. <laughs> yeah. All right. So as far as I got from these people, uh, yeah, what are you doing? This is the Magic Kingdom. Yeah. Dreams, realities, prices, blah, blah, blah. Let's go. There's really nothing here except a dancing pig man and then them tell me I need to go north. Am I going back down? Oh. So I wonder if like maybe I can go through that cave. I mean he's got moves. True that. This is such a weird timeline. Kajar and Blackbird. Small cave. <laughs> Guess we'll go to Kajar. Can't get that lore. Uh, this is the magic city of Kajar. We perform research in magical arts to help further Her Majesty's plans to deliver our kingdom even greater glory. Okay. Your power differs from ours. It's difficult to describe, but in you, I sense a strange kindness. It's not a power. Look, when they go, great power comes from responsibility. I don't go, oh, your kindness. Just saying. Well, there's something like air and milk coming on my books. In ancient times, people crafted wondrous weapons and armor by combining shards of a rainbow colored shell. With the sunstone's power. I've done that, I think. And now only the guru of life knows the art of crafting such things, and even if others did, the queen has ordered us to abandon the use of the sun's power. Uh, such beauteous continent. There is an unduly blossomed bud, but then I could be a flower. Cool. I wonder where a large cave is? Yeah, I was wondering where like medium cave? All right, it's one like, uh, I don't know, it's Ariel. 
carry all the fonts. That's the Sun Temple, which you see on the Southern Sky Isle. The Sunstone, once our primary source of power, was enshrined there. However, the temple was sealed up along with the Northern Shrine once we turned to our new energy source. Where was your source? The Queen claimed we have no need for the energy of the tired old sun. I don't think these people are very smart. I mean, I mean, they got a rock floating in the island, so maybe they're not that dumb, but... Why would you not use the sun? Okay. I have platinum armor too, but I need Her Majesty's permission to sell it. Ah, this queen's like... Just bug stop burning? I just want to read and there's fire coming out of my face. If I used font of recovery to format my paper, I wonder how many pages it would be. Imagine if it just recovers your actual text paper. Like what if I had to take these textbooks that are burning and I just have to throw it into the font of recovery? Would that restore the books? I feel like they would. Instead, they just use it to heal themselves. Makes sense. What tempest must rage in young Lord Janus's head? Hmm. Right. His only friend other than his sister is that cat that follows him about. Oh, so that little boy is Janus. He's a lord. Okay. Uh, we've been seeing a great deal of young Lord Janus lately. Before, he scarcely showed his face. But now he paces around quite often, always looking upset. Wait, what's that? Can I get up there? Oh, there. There's an item up there. Uh, Her Majesty Queen Zeal has two children. Lady Scala and her young Lord Janus. Lady Scala is an incredible child with extraordinary magical powers. With such a gift, her life must be all ease and luxury. Good for her. Good for her. Uh, my, you have an unusual aura. You must possess the gift, too. Yours seems very primitive compared to ours, though. You poor thing. Oh, fuck you. Uh, how is that we came to have powers? We do. Why do some possess the gift while others lack it? It is a conundrum. Your powers aren't as great. Fucking milk. This timeline's weird. <laughs> they don't like using the sun and all their books either spur fire, milk, or wind. It is genetics. <laughs> but I'm not worthy. Uh, it is only fitting after all, they lack our talent. I don't like these people. They're all just all high and mighty. The queen knows all the children are the best, blah, blah, blah. Who we got? And they all sleep. They all like to sleep. They like to burn their bucks. Like spurt milk out of their bucks. Wind come out of their bucks. Time New Romans heals you. And they sleep. That's all I got. A structure you can see deep within the beneath the waves below is the ocean palace, a symbol of the queen's greatness. The palace is the beacon of light which will guide us to the brighter future. All praise the great and wondrous Queen Zeal. No. <laughs> the Earthbound Ones. Oh, hey, Earthbound. Uh, the Earthbound Ones are being allowed to work on the construction of the Ocean, ocean Palace. It seems even they have their purpose. <laughs> they all drink their teas with their pinkies up. The audacity. Pinky's down, my friends. Pinky's down. Uh, the construction of the Ocean Palace has fallen behind schedule. An everlasting palace beneath the waves? It'll be a sight to see when it's finished. Behold, that out the window is the great blackbird. Fly away. Built by Belth. Belthasar. The guru of reason. <laughs> to see a soar across the sky, you think you'll... 
You'd think it alive. The guru is a genius. Balthasar. Thakar Thakatash. Such snobbery. <laughs> I dare say, such snobbery. Or even the shrubbery. Uh, the guru is a lifetime and reason to all the seal. Their knowledge and skills without equal. I had Monty Python in my head the rest of the night. <laughs> the great shrubbery. I heard Lady Scala's powers far surpassed those of her mother. Then there's her brother, young Lord Janus. He's of royal blood as well, of course, but he doesn't seem to have the faintest trace of magical ability. Just hasn't awakened yet. Uh, I've been working to the fashion the caps. No, it awake. Never mind. He can tell the future. Uh, I've been working to fashion the capsule that will enhance one's magical skill. Ah, but my precious products have been disappearing in recent days. Must be that naughty dude that took them. <laughs> they, do, they do so love pranks. <laughs> He's no doubt hitting them all about. How can I work like this? That's actually kind of cool. There's a lore behind the actual capsules that you find. Zeal's progress stems from our new energy source. His power far surpasses that of the sun's elemental energy. <laughs> God, I love Monty Python. Discord movie night sometime in the future when the stars align? Hell freaking yes. If we have to do either like Monty Python. I know we've discussed airplane. Um, I did find out you can watch airplane for free on YouTube, but it's with commercials. I don't think I would want to do that. I would want to get like a, an actual version to watch it, like without commercials. I thought I'm like, that's cool. There is others. Can't think of it right now though. I mean, hell, even the Monty Python, the entirety of Monty Python, the Holy Grail is on YouTube. <laughs> That's how I watched it. <laughs> uh, I heard a strange prophet has come to the palace. I do not know the details, but I heard he has powers most uncanny. I can always just uh, procure them as well. Indeed, indeed. I don't think this guy wants to talk to me. I was just like, no, no. All right, thanks. Water summons wind. Wind makes fire dance. So wind controls everything. <laughs> In a very legal manner. I believe you. I dare say. I'm thinking everyone here is like a witch. I'm just like, I need a duck. I'm seeing wind magic. I'm seeing fire magic. I'm seeing milk magic. <laughs> just burn them. All right, I didn't even listen to what she said. It doesn't matter. You know this traveler? The moonstone could be restored to a glorious sunstone if left to bask in the sun's warm light. It could also evolve a clefable. Uh, but such would require ions. None of us will ever witness the gorgeous glow again. You are very trustworthy. I would never say you're not. I do not mean that in a sarcastic way. I do trust you. You're worthy. Okay. Uh... I guess I talked to everyone. Let's go to Blackbird. Let's save. And then we'll go check out Blackbird. That's better. Hi. Why are you here? Yeah, I'm just figuring that out too. 
All is well with the Blackbird, I presume. She is fully operational, Lord Dalton. Of course she is, you blundering idiot. <laughs> Were she not, we'd all be in trouble. You, what are you doing there? Hmm, those clothes. You must be the ones the prophet said would come to interfere. I don't, don't know how I feel about this guy. <laughs> I think I shall watch for the time being and see how he plays his hand. I feel like this guy is just sassy. I thought I suspect he'll tip his card so easily. Ha. Huh. Can I kill him now? The blackbird's a symbol of Zeal's advancement. I don't know what you mean. It's my own imagination. Okay, so that was Lord Dalton. Uh, very nice individual. Guess we'll check out the small cave. It is indeed a small cave. The game did not lie there. This is such a, like a, uh, I don't even know, it's like Zeal Palace. All right, I guess we're gonna go say hi to the queen. Hello. This is the queen's palace in the center of the magic kingdom of Zeal. Which is to say, this is the center of the universe. Whoa. <laughs> I've just seen smaller. <laughs> Not impressed. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Portal to the Ocean Palace is in her majesty's audience chamber. Mind you, it hasn't been complete yet. Well, it wants a miss <laughs> The source of our energy rests deep below the sea once its exact location was, pre was determined. We began constructing the ocean palace there. There's so much where I'm just like, I don't know what's happening right now. Are you gonna... Never mind. Uh, the queen's two children, Lady Scala and Lord Janus, get along so well. It's a facade. If only young Lord Janus will open up to others. Uh, that pendant of yours? Looks like Lady Scala's, but it doesn't glow like hers. Like Marley's? Like descendants of Marley's, maybe? You do best to speak to the Queen of the Gurus if you wish to learn the, of the Mammon Machine. And the Ocean Palace. But just between you and I, I have not placed much faith in any answers Her Majesty gave you right now. She's been different as of late. <laughs> yeah, actually the same. Were you aware that the... Oh God, Belfathar, <laughs> the guru of reason, maintains secret chambers and, and, ha and Hansa and Kajar? I can't say these names. It is not my vocabulary to go Belfathar without saying like a... Like a yeah. Oh, sorry. I can't. Uh, that man appeared only recently, but he earned the Queen's trust quickly with a startling accurate predictions. His origins are a mystery. He's not one of us. Enlightened ones. But nor is he in an earthbound one. For where could such a man have come? Could be Magus? Balthar is not, uh, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, Itchy, could you? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> oh, right there, you got it. <laughs> Face. <laughs> Whew, thank you. Discover the new scratching spot. Was that actually... Wait, hold up. Like, is this actually going to be like an important plot thing? <laughs> found a secret. You found the scratching spot. 
that wandering prophet is amazing. Every prophecy to escape his lips have come to pass. It's as though he already knows the events to come. Unnerving, is it not? Okay, 100% this person is. Uh, maybe, I guess. Or maybe someone, I guess, is helping with. <laughs> Awkward. Don't know what you mean. You ever just, like, come up to someone and be like, I need to scratch your back? I scratch your back, you scratch my back. It's like, it's, it's all good. It's normal. Back scratchers. Even Balthasar, who designed the Blackbird in the Ocean Palace, has vanished. How strange that the three gurus who guided Zeal to its present day glory, present glory, have all disappeared at once. Suspicious. Uh, they say that Gaspar, the guru of time, continues his work on some deserted island. He strives to make a time egg or some such nonsense, but no one has seen him for years. Okay. <laughs> this way leads to the Mammon Machine Chamber. Alright, I'll come back. What are you guys doing? Wonder how the Guru of Life is doing. What are we supposed to do without him? Humans, I tell you. I want to be the wind, Masa. Oh. Our big sister Doreen went to the ends and haunts her. It's Masa and me. Yeah, she likes to dream. I like the wind better than dreams. Whoosh. The Queen's Council of Lord Dalton was in charge of the ocean's palaces construction until a wandering prophet arrived and took over. Lord Dalton's in a foul mood these days. Best avoid him if you can. Too late. Uh, the completion of the ocean palace will secure everlasting glory for the kingdom of Zeal. There will be no more fear of sadness, only eternal... Oh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Uh, let's go... Up here. The queen must have borne a great deal of pain and sorrow and silence. Progress requires equal sacrifice. Much must have been given to allow Zeal to attain the glory and now it does. <laughs> this way I'll take you to the bedchambers. That's why it leads to the great zombies chamber. Uh, listen to me, the earth is alive and always has been. She changes slowly so you never see it. From flylands to mountains, from mountains to sea. A uh, way may someday open even to the forbidden shrine in the north or to the sun temple, but it could take untold years. Or maybe a couple minutes. A couple hours. <laughs> uh, hello. A door cannot be opened from the outside, save with a powerful magic key like Lady Scala's pendant. Uh, uh, Her Majesty says she had business with the Ocean Palace. Let me pass until I return. Can I open it? Mine, mine somewhere, right? Nope. <laughs> Wait, where'd she go? Her Majesty says she had business with the Ocean Palace. Let me pass until I return. Okay. I was like, yeah, Marley's pendant. I wonder if that was going to open it. Uh, I guess we'll go to the bedchamber. Hello. Lady Scala's pendant was made from the same red stone as the Mammon machine. And she prays to the device the pendant glows with an unearthly light. Okay. Scala. Mammoth. <laughs> I want to keep saying mammoth. <laughs> it's just mammoth. Uh, oh, Janice, you've returned. Is something wrong? The black winds. You feel the foreboding too? Don't worry, it'll be alright. Here, keep this close. What is it? It's an amulet containing my prayers. If something which should happen, keep it safe. I wish I could remain with you always, but Mother has other plans.
That's not her mother. She looks like her, but she's not the same inside. Even still, forgive me, Janice. Pardons, your highness? <laughs> Pardons, your highness. There's people listening into your conversation here at the steps. <laughs> Keep your secret. Keep it safe. Keep it. The queen requests your immediate presence at the Ocean Palace. Very well. Well then, Janice, I must be on my way. <laughs> oh, who might you be? Busted. Forgive me, my lady, but we must hurry. We're late, I fear we'll I'll be well, you know the queen. Of course. My apologies. Hmm. Go away. Alright, thanks. Don't waste your time. Alf Alphador? Boy oh, likes me. I like the name. like Alfie for short. Gray Pitney? Yeah. Here, Alfie. Alpha do Prophet's aura is clad with hatred and sorrow. If he does not free himself for those emotions, he'll destroy himself and those he loves along with him. Okay, so whatever happened, I guess this prophet probably corrupted the queen of at least Lord Dolan, maybe. Unless Lord Dolan's just a dick. I mean, it could, it could be like that, too. Uh, beyond lies the Mammon Machine Chamber. You can feel the glorious energy of Lavo searching from it. Oh, no. The Mammon Machine? You came to see it? Yeah. I thought as much. Can you feel the flow of the mighty Lavos' power? Or it brings tears to my eyes. Yeah, it should. Oh, damn. If the Mammon Machine is moved to the Ocean Palace, we can extract even more energy from Lavos. The dream of eternal life will be made possible. And this is Alfie, my Shih Tzu. Oh, cute. It's short for Alphador. Oh, interesting. <laughs> the second response is, oh, interesting. Uh, oh, mighty queen, our kingdom will reign for all eternity. Y'all are screwed. <laughs> is this the fun of Zeal's power in the Mammon Machine? It draws and magnifies the limitless power of Lavos. That is terrifying. Operating the Mammon Machine requires a magic powerful enough to regulate the energy that the machine extracts. Accepting the Gurus, Lady Scala is the only one with such power. The three Gurus constructed the Mammon Machine from a reddish stone that had been kept in the Royal Treasury for generations. The Guru of Life, Melchior, was in charge of the plans and conducted a great deal of research on the natures of Lavos. But now, well, I'm sure you know the rest. Melchior, the Guru of Life, opposed the Queen's plans and disappeared shortly thereafter. It pains me to consider some conspiracy may be our work, but it's terribly suspicious. Wait, so Melchior... Melchior's from this timeline, but he's in present day. Okay. 90% of my social interactions. <laughs> oh, interesting. Sorry. When the Mammon machine was finished, the queen became a different person, although also overnight, a much colder one. Just between us and her, that any who pose her majesty, and not just the earthbound ones, vanish and never heard from it again. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> Can I, like, activate this? <laughs> I want to turn it on and just destroy the world. Alright. No? Alright, cool. So the red stone, that's the dream stone. Dream stone controls Lavos. And then Scala has one, which she just gave the Lord Janus. So Janus now has it. Now Janus can destroy the world. <laughs> Lovely. 
I was actually about to say I'm probably gonna wrap up myself. Yeah, it's already after 11. Um, Cause I actually have to get to bed. I have work in the morning, it's gonna be great. You know, thank y'all for being here. <laughs> I really do appreciate it. Um, let me figure out how the back, I always forget how the back out of this game. <laughs> I was in settings. There we go. PC games, am I right? Um, thank you all for being here, though. I really appreciate it. I feel like I always go a little, a little further into it today. It's like one of those games where it's like, I don't, I really don't want to put this down, but I know I have to. Thank you, so cool. Steak, draft. Can today be Friday instead of Monday? <laughs> That'd be nice. I'll sell for Wednesday. Actually, I will definitely sell for Wednesday. I don't have to be in my office on Wednesday, so I'll definitely take Wednesday. Yeah, have a good night, everyone. I really appreciate it. A game you don't want to put down? Never played one. How's Pokemon? I know, I'm kidding. Um, yeah, thank you for so much. I appreciate it. I'll be back on Thursday night. We'll continue this Thursday night. Um, and then we'll do uh, <laughs> put the Pokemon Nuzlocke on Saturday night. And we'll go from there. Thank y'all. I really appreciate it. I'm not going to raid. I'm going to just dip and sleep pretty much.